How Christmassy are you feeling? I've been feeling Mrs. Christmassy all week. Oh, lucky girl. We're sort of missing someone. Oh, Who's no. the chef? We forgot him. Ben. Ben. I'm not doing it. You oh, are come doing on. it. Why? Why Mate, do you, you always to... make me the butt of the joke? Why are you bringing butts into this? Will you come out? We're supposed to be friends. Ben, it's not on, a thing. You've out. made it a thing. Ben, why won't you come out? Dare to be different. Actually, hate you. You're gonna have to come actually out. hate you. Ladies and gentlemen, Ben Everall. Actually hate you. This was never a thing. There is nothing wrong with these. Here at Salted, we like to think we're growing up. So for 2014, I've adopted the habit of smoking. Food. What if we did that and then we give it our own kind of cocktail twist? Crowbarring booze into it. I yeah, like it. Yeah. So just put about a quarter of a pint into each one. We're just going to bring it up to the boil. That's a quarter of a pint, so... Stay away. Good glug. Yeah, perfect. That's great. Sure. Yep. Excellent. Really Excellent. Excellent. That's fine. That's fine. Do you ever eat meat and think, yeah, it's great, but it just doesn't taste enough like an air freshener? Well, with this hack, you can have the smelliest meat at the barbecue. Maybe some, oh, there's one of Mike's hairs. Oh no, whose hair is that? Janice. <laughs> Do you remember your first time? Of what? That gives me great pleasure. Yes. But I'll have to wait until after. <laughs> ben and I are jerking off in the kitchen. Now you all know that I love a good so once you've got your meth cooking, I want the flavours of kind of like espresso martini. <gasps> oh yes! That's my favourite cocktail. Here we are. I was always backing you mate, all the way. <laughs> That's the reaction I wanted. A bit more of the liquid up to the mix. How much? Up to the pint line. Perfect. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> no, seriously, that's fine. Photo of the week now, so you can't use the jingle. It, it, I can use the jingle. No, 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 no. Okay, I promise I won't use the jingle. Brilliant. So the photos of the week were actually a reaction from last week's comment of the week. Not food related, smuggle holster related. Uh, yeah. The pasta shapes, and I picked a shape that reminds me of Mike. It's called Giggly Al Bronzo. <laughs> Pronunciation may leave something to be desired. Mike, obviously, he's uh, he strains his hair already. He wears fake tan. Whiten teeth. Obviously. It's a t-shirt! Twenty! With sequins! Holes in your jeans! For ventilation, chef. Cue the music. Dare to be different. Dare to be wonderful. Please chill out, you mug! I've got to pay the bills. If you want to see more of his stuff, then you need to head over to his channel and you'll see plenty more. Off Donald stuff. And my bits. It's got so weird. <laughs> Wow. And all of a sudden, now we know what that's about. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, oh, wow. That's a munchable cylinder. So I guess you just kind of just... I don't know if you've heard about these, but the thing with Barry's Berries is they're really small. They're rarely seen, but they do an amazing thing when you put them on your tongue. And at Whoa. one point, I zhuzhed the nuts. There's some juggling of nuts, for sure. <laughs> flame! Meth burns with a clear flame. So you're smoking and cooking meth now. <laughs> Tutti fruity. Yeah. Oh, you <laughs> fool! You can see how soft our feta's got. It started to... Mush it, mush it, mush it. Wait! Why? I need to take my garlic out of its skin. Okay, so... Once you've finished slaving over the grill that you won't let anyone else help out with because you're a control freak and your therapist says you need to let go of the small things, but barbecue isn't a small thing, it's important and I'm not spending the next week on the toilet with Compiler to just because Terry's girlfriend Sandra fancied to go on the drumsticks. And I would say that is... Ta. And indeed, da. <laughs> You're going to decorate it? I've got some little sprinkles for you if you want. <laughs> Come on, care a little bit more than this. Let me see, I can't see. No, you don't want to. You, you don't want to. <laughs> sure. I don't have one of these tins. In that case, you can do it in just a round cake tin and put a ramekin in the middle. No. And then once you bake it, you can take it out. No, I'm not going to let you take the glory for this. Tom, that was your idea. I suggested that you can put a, a ramekin or as you probably, if you don't have a bunt in, you certainly won't have a ramekin, so a glass. Can I ask a question? You can try. Why are we so far down the bed? Like, get over bench. on your side. <laughs> Move down. Bench. Bench. Move down. By the way, what's Jamie's thing? Oh, he's got that massive beard. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's what it is. Sorry, let me stop you there. What's this? <laughs> It's a penis. They find that whisks always smell the same. <laughs> this is probably in my top 17. Mm. Adult jellies. Mm, I think Sorted. That's your name on it. You reckon? Yeah, go for it. <laughs> Let's sort this out. 
Instead of saying it's boring, it's very versatile. So what I like to do is... It's how James describes himself. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> And then hopefully it will give me time to do some dippy dippy, cooly cooly, glassy glassy, yummy yummy. <laughs> olive, olive. This is my favourite angle because Ben has to breathe in. <laughs> Leave my belly out of this. If I were a blackbird and this was piled up in my birdhouse, I'd think it's quite appetising. Off you go. Well, if you hold it a bit lower, it wouldn't be a problem. No, you... Bloody hell. Right, next up. You if you can... stole me. Next up, are you okay? I'm, I'm alright, I'll survive. So number one, it's we laugh and tell myself. you off. Number two, we ask if you're okay. Okay? Good. So you can always make it a little bit wetter than you think, because it's going to absorb it in the next minute or two as you serve it. Whap. Wetter. Wet-ass pasta. It's pasta. <laughs> What was that? that was the <laughs> reference you got? What was? No, Ebers, you do not want to know. <laughs> I'm telling you now, don't worry about it. It will blow your poor little mind. There's some Ebers in this house. I've got this the same search on. <laughs> Five seconds remaining. Whoa! No! No! Um... Oh, pepper. What is that? I'm going to give myself a three. Scallywag. Don't ask Ian. I sort of want to be him. In him I want to or cover him? him in cream. There you go, everybody. That was, that that was, was the fastest five minutes I ever remember. That was quite fast. I, you didn't do the thing. I thought you were going to go. Does he not know? He's sorted at oh, the end sorry, of the videos. Yeah, exactly. So there you go. That's, sorted. No. So there you go. That's our pesto chopping board pasta. Sorted. sorted. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>